What's up, Butterfly Gang? Welcome back to another Butterfly Message. I'm Aji, and this is Sacred Libra, where we talk all things Libra. Make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if this reading resonates with you. Wow. First things out the deck, a good partner. This is exactly what I wanted. The one everybody wants to be. This could be somebody famous or somebody just... <laughs> everybody wants okay um yes be mindful that the readings are timeless so this may be past present or future energies also be mindful that the readings are general so this may not resonate with everybody somebody's also thinking too much on the situation Yeah, somebody's also hit with some drama, drama, pettiness, and chaos at the wrong time. Like, it's like, now I got to deal with this shit. Somebody's for the streets. It could be a person that you're dealing with, like, they for the streets. And it's like, wow, this is out of the blue. Wow, this is out of the blue. Clink, clink, clink. Someone's meeting up and having some drinks or somebody's partying, getting together. Okay. There's a group of people that's in action on the right path, highly supported and admired. Wow, there's a friendship or a group of people and they're getting everything they want right now. The dream team. You got heartbroken at the bottom of the deck and it says, can't make a choice because I don't want to. Truth is they don't want to. Somebody decided to stay in some dysfunction. They didn't know what they wanted to do. They failed to make some type of choice. And as a result of that was some type of heartbroken energy. And it's like somebody knew that some energy was not good for them, but they decided to stay in it. Okay. This could be past energy. That's at the bottom of the deck. All right. Let's get into it. I got the old butterfly cards with the original butterfly cards with the new ones. Let's see. Let's see what we get today. What messages do we have for Libra? What messages do we have for Libra? It's always a good idea to do some shadow work, huh? What messages do we have for Libra? It says, don't freak out. You'll get through this like you did the last one. This could be the heartbreak. Somebody has dark skin. And also, it's time for someone to make peace with the past. Okay. Yeah, it looks like somebody's going to get back in action Watch after they make some type of peace, after they stop freaking out over something or um, giving something too much energy. Somebody's a patient listener. Yeah, somebody's a patient listener. They don't over talk you. They're not trying to over. They let you get your thought out. Somebody has dark soft skin. <laughs> Brown skin. Up against my brown skin. <laughs> Somebody got dark skin. Let's see what this is. And the T is. Oh, and naturally curly hair. Are they talking about me? What do spirit got to say about me? Dark skin, soft skin, naturally curly hair. Come on now. That sound like me. <laughs> that sound like me, okay? What they got to say about me? The T is, who look like me out there? Um, there's a random text. Also, there's a person judging. You're judging somebody off. Somebody judging someone off past experiences. So, this is not the truth. Um, this is not what's really happening. They're judging a the person off past experiences. Also, do some shadow work. Ew. Ew, do some shadow work. I don't know. I don't know what that's about. Okay. Somebody's purposely leaving out some type of details too. I don't know what that's about. Somebody needs to do some shadow work. Something happens. Okay. Um. <clears throat> hopefully we get into it in the reading. Okay, let's clarify this one. Not with the cards. <laughs> Describing me real quick. Okay. I 
right, let's get into this. All right, tell me more about a good partner. Who's a good partner for Libra? What's this good partner energy? Good partner. There's a Scorpio or a Libra that can be a good partner for you. Somebody's very mature. Somebody's very, very mature. Okay, somebody's very loyal. They're equal. They're about balance like you. You know, um, Scorpio is about um, analyzing and um, revealing, and, and ana but really about analyzing things. The King of Cups is analyzing. It's always in a place where he's thinking about and he's um, feeling things, making sure he feels things. And the Libra is also weighing out the scale. So very, very in tune with self and what's going on around them. Always. So somebody is going to be exuding your same type of energy. They're about balance and loyalty as well. Okay. And they're fun. It's like some new energy. They're really, really fun too. Libras like to have a lot of fun. Scorpios like to have a lot of fun too. Tell me more about this is exactly what I wanted. Some new energy. This new fun energy is exactly what it is you wanted. Yeah, <laughs> it is. You wanted this excitement. For some of you guys, there's some type of excitement or some type of travel. It's going to be really, really good for you. Trust your intuition. Um, it's going to be really, really good um, for you. Your intuition, not your fear. Your fear and something that's keeping you to stay small can keep you to stay in the box and keep doing things how you always did them. That's why it's and you need to go ahead and meditate. Be one with your feelings in tune with what's going on inside you and around you. Um, more, more so inside of you. I feel like this new energy, somebody wanted to be done with the past. Somebody wanted to be finished. And it's like, I, this is, I wanted all new energy. Somebody also, when it comes to dating or when it comes to friendships, they don't want nothing like they pass. If it reminds them of they past, they don't want it. They don't want nothing like they past, especially when it comes to intimacy. Tell me more about... Um, the one everything everybody wants to be. Who's the one everybody wants to be? The chariot. Of course, big energy was going to come out here. Big, big energy. Somebody's giving big, big energy. But then again, somebody is on their right path. They're doing the right things in life. They have a solid team. Okay, I felt the Empress coming out. I thought the Empress was gonna come out, but she at she at the bottom of the deck though. Um, somebody, this could be some 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 Empress energy. I do feel like there's a magnetic attraction between a very very high ranking person, a person who's like who has their head on straight. Okay, a person who's also in alignment. The Chariot is in alignment, and the Chariot the Chariot is not risking their alignment for somebody else. Okay, they're real mindful about their energy. Um, it's like anything aligned cannot be on this. And because of that, because of this, this person is not accessible to everyone. That makes them seductive. That makes everybody wants them or that makes everybody wants to it looks like their accomplishments and their success and their victories make everybody wants to be them somebody's winning somebody is winning here the empress is at the bottom of the deck um this could be you this could be you having your chariot moment you in alignment this empress it looks like this the angels are showing you are pushing you out and this could be you everybody wants to be or you could be connected with this person Tell me more about them fried your brain out. Think about what, Libra? Think about what? Think about money. Think about money. Thinking about a job opportunity, okay? Could also be thinking about a person. Do this person. Some of you guys that fried your brain out thinking about if a person notices you. So this could be someone famous or something like that. Somebody, because this is the one that everybody wants to be. So I'm pretty sure that's the one everybody wants to be with as well, Okay. Um, somebody could have um, fried their brain out thinking that if a person could, does a person see me? Is a person seeing me? Okay, you got the, got the king of wands over here. 
watching, looking, lurking. And it's like, I feel like somebody's not paying someone attention and it's bothering them. It could be throwing them off balance. Also, this could be work. Work could be frying someone out, um, working too hard. Tell me more about when it rains, it pours. Got the King of Swords here. King of Swords, what you going through? King of Swords has been through a lot. But the sun is coming out. King of Swords has been through a lot. But I feel like this got something to do with the truth. King of Swords found the truth about something. That's why he guarding something. Um, could be the truth about what a person truly feels. Or the truth about how a person's really... Yeah, the truth about what a person really feels. Um, for some of you guys, the King of Swords... Somebody is appearing strong because the King of Swords is very strong, disciplined, all that. Somebody is appearing strong, but they all it's already raining. So it's, it's already raining right here. They're just appearing strong. And it's like the truth that they found out or some type of um, pettiness that they found out about somebody's. Yeah. It's something that they found out. Some type of talk. Tell me more about... The drama, pettiness, chaos, and jealousy, competition for Libra. It's a burden. Ready to put it down. Ready to be done with it. What else? What else? You know who these people are starting these these um this drama here. This drama here. This is unexpected too. Unexpected. It's like you knew that the person had this type of energy, but it comes out the blue. What else do we have? Yes, wow, this is out the blue. What else do we have here? Yeah, this could be a person who's just... It has a lot to do with jealousy. Jealousy is big. That beast got real, real big. It's like you knew that a person was jealous. You just didn't know what they were capable of, what they were going to do, okay? Um, yeah, you didn't know what they were mixing up. You didn't know what they were doing. You knew that... It'd be smart if I keep my distance a little bit, but you didn't know exactly what a person was capable of. Tell me more about For the Streets. Who For the Streets? Somebody is trying to, it's like somebody is trying to get over somebody by getting under somebody else. The Four of Swords is the rest from the heartbreak of the Three of Swords. But the rest that you're getting is for the streets. Okay. Somebody is definitely out there. Not, not saying this, you know, they just stay outside. Tell me more about um for the streets. This energy. Yeah, break up. Yeah, somebody broke up. Somebody <laughs> broke up with a person and they, and they outside. They're outside. Oh, we outside this summer. Yeah, they, they're they happy. They okay. They did a whole pivot. Somebody's going to do a whole, a whole turn. <clears throat> a whole pivot. Tell me more about wow, this was out of the blue. There's a, there's a celebration that's out of the blue. Wow, no. <laughs> Mm -mm. there's an argument between friends that's out of the blue yeah and then you tell them you roll out for some of you guys you're not gonna be knowing that you're gonna be like getting into it with your friends this bad and it's gonna be out of the blue or with some close people this bad like it's out of the blue what's it about this could be about some type of betrayal this could be also about a lie, something that somebody tried to keep in the dark, keep hidden, keep some. It's like um, somebody tried to keep something hidden from you, secrets. I could, I feel like it could also be like um, gossip too. Also betrayal. Tell me more about um, clink, clink, clink. That's the three of clubs too. 
got the justice. It looks like there are some loyal people out there that you do get in contact with. You got the Queen of Swords, two people. Like I said, there's two people who definitely, who definitely, you know, honor loyalty. Like, you know, people say loyalty doesn't exist no more, but it's very serious to Libra. Even though they say we go wherever the wind blow, but no. It's very serious for them and being fair and being truthful. Like somebody wasn't truthful and shit hit the fan in a, in a friendship or a relationship or a group of people or something like that. It, it goes out of the blue, okay? Um, there's also an unexpected call. It could be an unexpected gathering with people that you can definitely trust. Tell me more about clink, clink, clink. Yeah, could be a travel. Could be traveling, could be going to a place. It's definitely going to be fun, okay? Um, I feel like it took a long time for you to actually express your feelings or a long time but i do feel like loyalty somebody is also loyal and somebody the way that the way that a person feels and they're showing you to showing you is honest it's not like that they, they are saying all these good things to you and then down the road you realize that those were lies and then you did you find out what they really feel about you no they're actually telling you what they really feel about you they actually telling you that they really love you okay tell me more about an action on the right path Yes, claim it. Empress is an action on the right path. Is that why she was? Yeah, that's look. That's that's what the chariot is. In action on the right path. Okay. Um. Definitely in a better situation where you can take care of other people and yourself. All right. Um. I feel like once once spirit shines some type of light on some negative energy that you moved away from, you were able to get yourself back on the right path, okay? Tell me more about highly supported and admired. Tell me more about highly supported and admired. I got the Knight of Cups. You're highly supported and admired by somebody. Multiple people. Somebody's going to be telling you that how they feel. Like I said, when they tell you this, this is their true. This is how they truly feel about you. It's how they truly feel about you. That you. Some of you guys are going to be confused. Like, can I believe this? Which is understandable from what you just came from, this betrayal. But it wasn't a 10. <laughs> it wasn't a 10 of swords. You were able to bounce yourself back from something. But then again, it's like, could I believe this? Yeah, you can. Tell me more about everything that I want I already have. Yeah, somebody got a new perspective of their life. Transition. A rebirth. They look at their life totally different. Now they look at their life with in abundance. With the ten of cups at the top of the deck. They look at their life like a bun like it's abundant instead of and lack instead of I need to go get what I want or I wish I had this. They're like, no, I already have it. It says when you didn't have what he said when I um before you were clothed in sandals or whatever you lacked nothing. I forgot that. I need I need to actually get that verse and put it on one of my message cards. Okay, get that Bible verse and go ahead and put it on one of my message cards. Because it is facts. Facts. Alright. Let's get into these. Okay. Tell me more about don't freak out. You'll get through this one like you did the last one. What's this? Yeah. Some of you guys are freaking out because of the ton, the load that you have on your back. You'll get through this. You'll find a solution just like you found the solution last time, right in the nick of time. Right in the nick of time, you'll find it out. You're smart. Use your brilliant mind. The king of pentacles is, is the investor. You're wise. Use your wisdom. To go to spirit. Be one with spirit. It's like you're going to get through this. This overwhelming time, this harsh workload, this burden, just like you did the last one. Okay, that's to bring some light to someone. 
Remember, for reflect on the time when you thought you wasn't going to make it. And look at you making it and shit. Okay? Um, tell me more about dark skin. What is about this dark skin person? Wow. There's a person. That's the person signing all the drama. Says, that ain't, they ain't talking about me. They may look like me. But they ain't talking about me. That, yeah, that's a person here that has dark skin. Darker shade. Maybe tan. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, but darker skin. And they're starting a lot of the drama that's going on. They're starting it. Okay. They're starting. Somebody can't be trusted. Coming out of the blue, too. Somebody's coming out of the blue. This could be a person that you just met. All right. Somebody, they're starting all of the blue. They may just be jealous. Tell me more about soft skin. Somebody, there's a person with soft skin that's going to apologize. Yeah, that's a person with soft skin that's going to apologize or feel like that they need to apologize. Tell me more. No need to apologize. Oh, it's a too late. It's too late. You see that? It's too late. That's a person who felt like they need to apologize, but it's too late. By the time they hit up, by the time they get to the door, you're going to be gone. I feel like this ain't you at the door. I feel like that's not you. That's somebody answering the door like, listen, they gone. <laughs> um, Somebody going to be, yeah, they gone. Yeah, this is the queen of pentacles. Or it could be the temperance energy. They gone. They out working. Somebody is too late to apologize for someone. Um, and this could be somebody who's who's trying to like apologize for hurting you in a love relationship. And it's like, I don't want to hear it. Okay, tell me more about the T is. What's the T? What's T, sis? What's the T? The T is that the King of Swords and the um Queen of Wands is. <laughs> okay. Yeah, somebody's bringing you, look at that, bringing you to see you minding your business. And somebody's going to be talking about a, possibly an Aquarius and possibly an Aries. Somebody's going to be talking about a person. Um, This possibly could be a person in power um, in the Aries. And so I feel like somebody's going to be hating on an Aries, hating on a woman who looks good, okay? Um, They could also be hating on this man, too. What is it about this? This energy. Somebody is talking about somebody dating. This also could be somebody dating. Um, it looks like somebody is curious about a, a person. And the reason why they're curious about this person is because they don't dabble into their personal life. So somebody who ever comes and talks about this male who never dabbles into their personal personal life, it's all lies. No matter how juicy, how entertaining it may be, it's all lies. You know how this person operates. Then also, I feel like this other person, they just hating on this person. They're, they're intimidated that by this person's fire. They're intimidated by this person's light. That's why they come in to talk to um, you about to be mindful about what you say to this person because once they give you that tea, whatever you say to them, they're going to take that shit and run with it. So be careful uh, to give them the uh-huh, uh-huh, right, right, give them that. It could be divine masculine. Yeah, this person could be talking about divine masculine, a divine masculine person, um, Emphasis on Aries. Tell me more about make peace with the past. Yeah, it's a new beginning. It's a new day. It's time for you to make peace with the past. It's time for you to truly leave the past behind you and move on. It's a new day. Hop on that new ship and stop waiting. It's a new day. Somebody has the clarity. It's almost. It's like also the storm is over. And it's definitely a new day. So definitely make peace with this past because the storm is over. Okay? Tell me more about back in action. 
back in action. You got this page of cups in reverse here. Wow. There's a, okay, somebody, the karmic is back in action. And this is a liar. Somebody's a liar. The liar is back in action. That could be this person coming right to you with this, yeah, coming right to you, spilling the tea. Coming right to you. Somebody coming in right to you, knowing damn well. And look, hey, look at the cup. Somebody coming right to you, knowing damn well you don't care. Don't speak on this situation. But the liar is back in action. Somebody is here to like disrupt some type of peace that you have. Disrupt your peace. Tell me more about natural curly hair. Queen of Pentacles got naturally curly hair. That's that person who they was looking for. Is that the Queen of Pentacles? Got naturally curly hair. What about the Queen of Pentacles? Yes, yeah, she's getting a lot of attention right now. Could be her hair. Um, getting a lot of attention. Yes, yeah, she's getting a lot of attention. She got she has an admirer. Okay. Or there's a guy who has an admirer. Okay. Um, there's also somebody who's trying to reconcile. It looks like that. If a person is thinking about you, they're thinking about your naturally curly hair. Maybe they like to run their fingers through your hair. Or they loved your hair. Or they have a hair fetish or some shit like that. Okay. Tell me more about a random text. What's this random text? <clears throat> wow. Somebody's going to be sending a, a random text that's going to divide something, break something, tear something apart. Um... It's going to be unexpected. Out of the blue. Tell me more about this. There's a nasty ass text. Tell me more about this random text. What is it? Yeah, it's all lies too. All lies and illusions too. Okay. It could be about somebody. It could be about somebody's kids. It's like somebody's text message is going to get exposed. Exposed text messages. Tell me more about a, a patient listener. Yeah, somebody's a patient list listener. Somebody's not judgmental. They're not stuck in their ways. They, they think outside of the box, too. Got this nine of pentacles. And it's because they're happy. Yeah, they think outside of the box. Tell me more. Somebody's very patient with the person, even though they have not made up their mind yet. They're still in limbo. They could also be repeating the same mistake. And the person's very patient with them. It's like they never judge them, so they feel safe, okay? Um, tell me more about judging them off past experiences. What's this energy? Oh, somebody's judging a lover off pat off the past and not off the future. In the future, they're in alignment, but somebody keeps judging this lover off the past. You got the justice card here. Is it you? Is it you that's judging them? It could be like you. This could be their karma. Like some mistakes you gotta pay for. Some mistakes you can't really, you know, get out like that. What else do we have? There's a new solution. Somebody could just want something new. They could just be bored and they just want something new. Like the trust could just be gone in the situation. Um, it looks like there's something that's about to be exposed here. Uh, it looks like this person really wants to work together with you. So I feel like there's a communication that needs to happen. What else? There's some communication that needs to happen here. Okay, this could be with the emperor here. Um, it looks like somebody was infidelity. Somebody lost lost trust. Trust is not there. And um, now it's nothing that a person could do. They judging a person off their past. Okay. All right. So that is the reading that I have for you guys today. I hope this reading resonated with you. 
If it did, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up and make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video.